what is going on y'all welcome back to the channel we are here today at a small farm pond y'all seen this pond before and we're here with my buddy garrett you want to say hi hey buddy how's everybody so, doing garrett's been fishing for years hardcore bass fishing and uh he's he's got the game pretty dialed in and he's he's pretty damn competitive down the road he's going to teach us a few things um teach them teach us some stuff about crankbaits and jigs and just stuff i know nothing about but today we're going to have a competition we're going to we're going to use these uh lunker hunt baits you got a big old black widow spider and a dragonfly garrett thinks the dragonfly is going to do pretty well so he's going to tie it on and I've been itching to use this this spider, so I'm gonna use it, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna see who catches the first bass and the most bass within an hour. But we ain't gonna screw around anymore. Let me get these things tied on. Go crank one out. See you there. Shut up and sit down. Too big for this I don't know why they should use like a two otter. I've got other hooks if you want. It's a challenge that came in the box. Alright. This is like a four otter or five otter hook. You need something smaller than that for this. As long as I can keep it straight, I'm good. Ready? Come on. Off of this, of one of these, and then you can switch to whatever you want. Or you want to catch this, use this for one hour. Uh, let's let's do who catches the first bass, and then we'll we'll fish these for an hour. See who catches the most. I just saw something move right there. All right, let me uh, let me get the timer set. Hi, Bixby. Set timer for one hour. I'll start your timer for one hour. These are the worst conditions for top water. All right, y'all, we're all tied on. You gonna head that way and I'll head this way? Yes, sir. All right. We got the timer set, ready to go. And I threw a giant backlash right off the rip. I'm gonna go ahead and reel it in. Just reel it right over top of the backlash. This thing's got crazy action on it. I might actually have to change poles. I got a little tiny bass down here following it. Oh no. Dude, this is the worst backlash I have ever seen. Wasting time. I'll wrap it around the arm of that and try to spool it out. I got it. 
I got it to the end of the backlash and I got to reel it all back up. Yes. Crank the brakes all the way down on this thing. All right, let's try this again. Still backlash the crap out of it. We are at a disadvantage here, boys and girls. A disadvantage. This sucks. Last time we were here, it was cloudy. Oh, that's why. I had the brakes turned the wrong way. Holy crap. Much better. I had the brakes turned the wrong way. Last time we were here, it was cloudy, it was cold, and the bass were tearing up that top water stuff. I just jumped, jumped a huge bass off this bank. I'm gonna cast it right along the bank. Oh, that's on the bank. Let's see if maybe something will come out from under one of these lips. You get one? Yeah. Now he got one on the dragonfly. He won that part of it. Nice. Oh, I just got hit. Get back out there. Hit again. There we go. I think in the shade is the juice. Get the whole water squeezed out of that thing. Right, let's get it out there. Right along the edge. There, it's floating now. Oh, three times. I, I've had a, a hit three times. I keep missing it. I'll leave it sit there for a second. Just give it a little twitch every now and again. They ain't wanting to flip too well. I think we may have missed our window of opportunity. Oh, he got two. Come on, little spider. We gotta get this thing done. Come on, spider. We gotta get at least one. I don't know if it's the fluoro, what it is, but the spider kinda sucks. I've been so excited about this thing. And it just wants to run nose down, sinks a little bit, and then wants to run just under the surface of the water. I got one down here that just keeps following it, but I think it's the one that you already caught. I think his face is sore. Did they hit, did, did they hit it hard when you hit it? Dude, I remember one came up and just completely gulped it. Really? Gulped it. 
So, do those along. slide through there? Huh? Do those slide through? You mean the wings? No. Oh, yeah, actually they do. Oh, okay. I thought they've been torn apart. I'll throw some glue on them. Yeah, I got over there up under that tree in that shade. I was to say, some fishing 101. Yeah. Caught every single fish. As soon as I got here, I said, oh, we're fishing top water. It's 75 degrees, almost 80 yeah. degrees. Bluebird skies. This is the worst conditions of fish top water. It is. Fish don't have eyelids, obviously. So I was like, very first thing I did, walked right to that dock where yeah. the shade, threw it underneath that dock, didn't really get a bite. Got a swirl, got, didn't really get a bite. Threw it underneath there about four or five more times. Then I threw it alongside that bank where I know there's structure. Uh -huh. I know that they hang out a lot. Nothing. Then, then I was like, all right, bet, shade. Walk over here, got the first one with shade. Walk over here, threw it alongside the bank through the shade. Second one. Walk back over there after I let the place calm down a little bit. I got that third one, but I took the hook too hard too fast. I think both of them need to be tied on either braid or uh, mono. Mm -hmm. And I keep braid or mono with me. But like I said, I think early morning. Let's see what's like. Yeah. With the wood. Garrett's all happy. We've only got 26 minutes left on the timer. And I'm two fish down. Two to zero. We need a fish to just get pissed at this spider. I'm done with this fluorocarbon after today. It's all getting stripped off of here. Going back to braid. I use light braid on this rod, but we're on this combo. There's a carp out there about four foot long. I just got swirled on. Huh? Ah. Get back out there. There we go. Ah. Oh. Just missed that one. Let's see if I can get him to go after it one more time. I'm, I'm riding that struggle bus hard, man. Yeah. I'm trying to be patient too and like let them take it. It's like they're grabbing hold of the legs and that's it. I think I'm gonna try a Ned rig. Yeah, oh. This one? Yes. Had it in his mouth too. Had it choked. Spooked one there. Mm -hmm. There we go. Come on, baby. Well, that's a nice bass, too. Come on. You did. Get up here. Oh, you got teeth. There we go, boys and girls. Not a bad bass. All right, y'all. Looks like a nice female. I don't think she spawned out just yet. Maybe two, two and a half pounds. The old spider got her dead. We get her back in the water. There you go, girl. Took off out there. All right, we did not get skunked with a little black widow. And the timer hasn't gone off yet.
Oh, kidding me. Time. Yep. You're the man. All right, y'all, that's it. It's been an hour. It's gonna be my last cast on this. I'll go grab something else. All right, y'all, that's it for the fishing challenge. Your boy lost. I, I caught one. Got a whole bunch of strikes. Thought I was gonna get that last one up on the bank and it just let go, just spit it out. So we gotta go over here and tell Garrett congratulations through gritted teeth. Uh, he, uh, he did good. The dragonfly did good. Like I said, this, this little spider here, I think it'll, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to get my A-Rig out. Do it. Still can't but, catch uh, up to me, though. Yeah, probably not. But, uh, anyway. I, oh, I, hey, Garrett. Congratulations. Thank you. I just wanted to, I wanted to make sure I said that for, for everybody online. Yes, sir. But, y'all stay safe. Stay happy. The hell out of the fishing spot. All right, y'all, a little bonus fishing here. I'm gonna throw this A-Rig out here and see what happens. Actually, I see a bass on a bed. I'm gonna grab this Ned Rig. See if I can't get this sucker. <laughs> 